She was entrusted to rid the city of abandoned vehicles, but instead, police say a city worker was actually part of an elaborate auto theft ring. Jolie Winaga is live in North Portland now, digging deeper into this investigation for us. Joel? Kelly, good evening to you. The suspect, we are told, is a 20 year city employee with the Bureau of Transportation. Police tell me that she was accepting cash kickbacks from illicit tow truck drivers. Well, Coin Six News was there when she bailed out of jail, and watch what happens. Saying you're involved in an auto theft ring. Moments after she was released from jail, Veteran Portland Bureau of Transportation well, worker Barbara guys, Peterson so. wanted nothing to do with us when we asked her about her alleged involvement in an elaborate auto theft ring. Portland Bureau of Transportation is investigating this matter. Uh, there's an ongoing police investigation. I've learned Peterson has worked for the Portland Bureau of Transportation's Abandoned Vehicles Department for 20 years. Police tell me she was receiving cash for providing information on abandoned vehicles to tow truck drivers who would then steal the vehicles and bring them to West Coast Car Crushing. Detectives raided West Coast Car earlier this month, making a number of arrests. Towing critic Sean Cruz tells me this is likely just the tip of the iceberg. You're not surprised by this, Mr. Cruz? I'm not surprised at all, you know, and it's kickbacks are part of the system. They're part of the towing system. PBOT, meanwhile, will not discuss the investigation, but says Peterson is still an employee. Employees are not paid when they're in custody. Uh, but when they're not in police custody, uh, they're still employed pending uh, the investigation. Back live now, Barbara Peterson, I am told, will be arraigned in Multnomah County Court sometime tomorrow. In the meantime, uh, her official charges include misconduct and conspiracy to commit unlawful use of a motor vehicle. We're live in North Portland. I'm Joel Iwanaga, Coin 6 News, Kelly.